Pan Tadeusz is one of the most important literary pieces in Polish history. It's uh, 12 books written by Adam Mickiewicz, which is Polish national uh, poet, and this is a Polish national epic, translated into 33 languages. It was waiting a long time to be adapted for screen, but Andrzej Wajda, the master of Polish cinema, decided to do it in 1999. There is a range of topics that Pan Tadeusz, which is Mr. Tadeusz actually, is about. There is Napoleon War, there is a countryside, there is nobleman conflict, there is love story between two young people. It's going to end better than in Romeo and Juliet, tiny spoiler. There is a beautiful depictions of nature. And in the film, we have a set of the most famous Polish actors. Everybody was really engaged into the production. There was a lot of enthusiasm. So we can see that in the way the film is made, but at the same time, we can hear it in the music. It's the, another collaboration between Andrzej Wajda and Wojciech Kilar, but a really specific and interesting one. The music was composed before the film. Wojciech Kilar wrote famous Polish dance, Polonaise, and sent it, recorded already, to Andrzej Wajda, saying, this is the music for the film, please follow it and make a film accordingly to it. For Andrzej Wajda, it was something extraordinary. Why I get the music before the film? But at the same time, it structured the film and it gave it momentum and it gave it energy. And the Polonaise itself, the one that we can hear in the film, is a really popular music in Poland. Every school, every high school uses it once a year. There is a special ball called Studniówka, a hundred days before final exams in every Polish high school. And during the ball, every student has to dance Polonaise, you're going to see on screen what it looks like. At the same time, the music that Wojciech Kilar composed was uh, taken from another project that never happened. And it's also an interesting anecdote. Mm, when Wojciech Kilar started to work in Hollywood, he was one of the composers that Peter Jackson was thinking of when making The Lord of the Rings. He wasn't chosen, as we know from the history, but some of the parts of music are used in Pantadeusz. Is it more epic than Lord of the Rings? You're going to judge it yourself.